Welcome to The Daily Writer, where we share a lesson each day to help you cultivate the habits for creative success. These lessons are inspired by great artists, authors, and thinkers, both past and present. For more, you can visit us at dailywriterlife.com. What is a professional? It seems like such a simple question. A professional baseball player is a person who plays on a pro sports team. A professional attorney is a person who has a legal practice. A professional plumber is a person who's been licensed by the proper authorities. And judging by those examples, a professional writer is a person who gets paid to write, correct? Well, it would seem pretty cut and dried, but we writers have a bad habit of complicating things, especially when it concerns our creative identity. The aviation and fantasy writer Richard Bach helped shed some light on this issue when he said, A professional writer is an amateur who didn't quit. In addition to just being a great quote, there are three important lessons here. First, we're all amateurs. That doesn't mean we are amateurish or that we do sloppy work. It just means that all of us are constantly in learning mode. We never become the master who knows everything. Second, it means we don't quit. We keep going. We keep moving forward, even when we're discouraged and our progress is slower than we would like. And third, it means that if you're an amateur, you can become a professional. Yes, of course, it also means you can get paid for your work, but there are plenty of amateurish writers who get paid for their work. It's more than just the money. It means you take your writing seriously and you show up as a professional. It doesn't matter how big or small your audience is. It doesn't matter how much you're getting paid or even if you're getting paid at all. Any amateur can become a professional through hard work, discipline, and the sheer stubbornness of never quitting. Thanks so much for listening to this episode of the Daily Writer Podcast. We really appreciate your support and hope you enjoyed this. You can find more at dailywriterlife.com.